Hello, everyone, and welcome to the 28th episode of Monster Mates. That's a lot of episodes. It is. Uh, Spencer, I need you to choose a number between 1 and 67. So close to 69. We're, we're getting there. We might get there in season two. Ooh, spoilers. Yes. Um, I'm going to go with... Give me 11. 11. We're, we're gonna hit, Ghost we're gonna, Girls. Ghost Girls. Okay, we, I'm surprised we, I hadn't hit 11 yet. I was so ready to like hit hit something. You've, you've hit very close to it, but no. I, think I, hit, I remember rolling. hitting 12, I think. Yes, you did. Yeah, okay. So my, my, my memory is not that shot yet. <laughs> Keyword being yet, but all right. So Ghost Girls. They look pretty. Mm. Give you that typing ASMR, boys. Of course. Absolutely. All right, Ghost Girls. Okay, so I'm thinking... So what kind of Ghost Girls, like... Okay, off the bat, what are you rating mm -hmm. Ghost Girls? I'm going to rate Ghost Girls probably a six. Well, actually, this is really appropriate for October. Mm-hmm. So it's great. Yeah. Um, so we're doing this. Yeah, in October is great. Um, a six. I would probably a six. Yeah. Okay. A six five five six sounds pretty good. Because. Okay. Are we talking mm -hmm. Buet here, or are we talking <laughs> Sadako? Oh goodness, Buet. We're talking Buet, not Sadako. We're, we're not doing Sadako. That's a. I'm gonna say that's a different category entirely. <laughs> Damn it! I wanted to. Ha I wanted to fuck the busty TV girl. No, you can't. You can't do Sadako. That's a no, revenant. We will get there later. I want to do it halfway through the TV. We'll get there later. Damn. All right. All right. All right. So. Hmm. Do we can we even touch them? Uh, quotes from the encyclopedia entry: Since they don't have a body after just having been born, they can't directly touch humans. <laughs> okay, so like we get nothing. <laughs> yes, it, nothing happens. Hold on. Um, How do we get pleasure from this? Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna read out the rest of this paragraph entry. Okay, uh, fine. To, and when they find a man, they take possession of him and try to suck his spirit energy out little by little. Once they take possession of someone, they are able to forcibly unify their thoughts with those of their host. In this way, they are able to send their wild fancy fantasies directly into the man's mind. The man being possessed will be tortured by the lewd scenes of them they are constantly fill that are constantly filling their head. Oh. Oh, so they fucking mind jack you and start yeah. jacking you off in your head. Yeah. Huh. So basically, since they can't physically do anything, they have the lewdest of thoughts, and when they take possession of you, they put their thoughts into your head. <laughs> You know that fetish that you thought was fucking weird? But guess what? Now it's You're into it now. <laughs> now you're into it. Like, oh, I'm not into uh, feet. Now I'm super into feet. Oh, no. no. Oh, no. Okay. What if they, like, found, gave you, like, the worst fetish thing ever, and you're just like, ah, um, no. Oh, actually, I just read the next paragraph down. So here, here we go. All right. Eventually, after sucking out enough spirit energy, they materialize. And by that time, the man's head is so full of them that he starts to yearn for them. Does that so. mean that uh, we want to kill ourselves to be part of them and be ghost boys? No, because they're materializing. Therefore, they can physically touch us. Yeah. So does that mean they come back alive? Well, no. They but they have a corporeal body. Like they have a physical thing. They're still they're still an ethereal like entity, but they still but they have physical properties now. I see. So they're filling my head with dirty thoughts of me fucking them. And then once they get enough energy to be physical, 
then you can actually do those things. I see. Yes. I understand now. Mm hmm I mean, I think the idea of them being like, I'm going to put all my fucking fetishes into your head, directly into your brain, is interesting. Mm-hmm. <laughs> From my head directly to <laughs> your ass. Uh, I'm sure there's a fetish about that exact just, scenario just, somewhere. Listen, listen, I'm just scared that one of them is just going to straight up be like, all right, pegging. Uh, I'm just scared one of them is just going to straight up just want to do it. But, like... Yeah. I don't know. I mean, I guess if you're into the ghost thing, man, it's like, here you I go. I mean, if you're, if you're into possession, then, hey, dude, there you go. Dude, those stories of people who fucking... <laughs> the people who yeah. go like, I had sex with a ghost and we're in love. Don't remind me. <laughs> I, oh I love... I, dude, goodness. those stories kill me. They straight up go... They straight up are like, uh, we are engaged... It's like, excuse you, bitch. You're not Whoa. boning ghost. You're just lonely, like the rest of us. <laughs> like the, accept your loneliness, like the rest of us, and stop fucking the ghost. The ghosts don't want to fuck you. No, they just want to get on with their afterlives. They just th in their after sex, not yes. with you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like, I would imagine in a ghost form, like much similar to the slime girl everything's a g-spot well especially if you like oh my god like <laughs> you you put your okay question yeah. for you mm -hmm. if say you put your hand through where their like vagina is not actually mm -hmm. in the vagina but like in front of them through them do they yes. then still feel the pleasure yeah i'd say so <laughs> oh no bad thoughts bad thoughts are entering yeah. my head of what i want mm -hmm. to do no this mm -hmm. is this is i'm the fucked up one i'm the bad one here are you sure about that i think so okay because i want to brain fuck them yeah yeah just straight up all right i mean there's a there's a perfect website for you to go do that and that's called shadbase.com Sh excuse oh shadbase yeah 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 that, uh, yeah, that I know that that collie one, man. Didn't yeah, think be, didn't think I'd like that, but here we are. <laughs> here we are. Same, same. Uh... I'm not same. I've watched that more times than I'd like to admit. <laughs> <laughs> but here we go. Uh... It's on recording. Great. Yeah. Mm hmm. Hello, world. Uh... I will not be running for politics anytime soon, and neither they will be... shall I. <laughs> They shall be using this against me, and if they do use this against me, embrace it. Embrace it. Call them pussies for not being into brain fucking. Mm hmm. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> anyway. So, so from just from generally like reading those two paragraphs, they just seem to be constantly thinking degenerate thoughts at all times and that's kind of cute i have to admit you, you, it's cute yeah it's, it's cute you're over cute. here be like oh it's so cute how you're just such a fucking degenerate <laughs> yes it's adorable so if she, she if she's imagining writing you like a crazy woman and doing all these things you're just like ahigeo face everywhere and then you're just over here like oh, aren't you just a little cutie yes exactly <laughs> these ghost girls are precious and i will fuck every single one of them yes either in their corp Either in their corporeal oh, I thought you were form saying or, their, in in their, or their incorporeal form. Not their corpse. That's necrophilia. <laughs> yeah, that's... I don't get... I, yeah, no, I'm, I'm good that's, on that one. That's when we get to the zombie episode. <laughs> yeah, then we kind of get to... Is it really necrophilia then? And then it gets to a whole place that, mm, I'm not okay. Where we'll, where we'll actually have to discuss that. We'll actually have to discuss whether if that's even okay or not. Oh, goodness. But we'll we'll wait till then that, to discuss. That's that. another bridge for another day. That is another motherfucking bridge. Now, 
if okay okay so question yes so since uh-huh. this is this this is going with a very classic ghost design of having like casper the friendly ghost a little like no tail but just like a floating little tendril whatever thing you want to call it at the bottom instead of legs yes would you get a uh what what would it even be called i don't know but would you get a would you a get ghosty. would you get it hmm? you get a ghosty yeah get a ghosty would you get a ghosty <laughs> the problem is i don't even know what a ghosty is and i just said it i'm just like just the, just the end of their tail jerking you off oh uh, um yeah yeah I, is that even that was a question yes yeah okay i 110 percent. i would let them do that to me yeah same yeah i don't i don't think listen you gotta go mm-hmm. a little adventurous when you go to that route you know <laughs> mm-hmm. because the second you start and going no man that's weird the second you start doing that is the second you're not even into monster girls anymore <laughs> the, the second you acknowledge the fact that you're like i'm down to try weird shit and if we're not trying weird shit what are we even doing here mm-hmm. that is when you recognize that you are into monster girls and you are stronger for it in my mm. opinion yeah probably Listen, if if you wanted just to fuck a normal girl and you didn't have the fantasies of listening to this and doing monster girls, like, no one would be here. <laughs> True. No one would be here. No one would be here. We wouldn't even be talking about it. We wouldn't this. even be talking about it if we there weren't people out here like us. So the fact that, that people want this, the, mm-hmm. the fact that people want to, li- like, do this is you have to be adventurous i would let her i would i want to see what happens if she goes through me i want to see the feeling of having them big titties going right through me in corporeal form speaking of which i was just thinking about this you wouldn't be able to get a boob job from them really unless they're like or in their incorporeal form anyway okay can they possess people right yes I wonder if you could... Uh, Are you thinking of some sort of, like, transformation fetish thing? Maybe, yeah. Okay. Because I, I don't think that really applies to this I, specific I thing. don't think it does either. That's kind of why I was hesitating. Because I'm, like, I'm thinking, oh, I yeah. I think that's more of a phantom than a ghost. But that's uh, just me. A phantom or a ghost? They're a subcategory. Darn it. Daddy fan. <sighs> Goodness gracious. No, but in all in all realness, I think the whole I don't know, this is a weird one. Because we've been talking about this for a while, and the positives mm-hmm. are Okay, okay. Negatives. You can't really touch them unless they suck some of your fucking life force. Mm-hmm. So I wouldn't want a ghost girlfriend. Oh no! Normally, no, 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 no. I would want a ghost girlfriend, and not at all. I would have brothel. Give me a brothel yeah. for ghosts. Let me pick my girl. Let me pick a. I'm gonna take the revenant. I'm gonna take a phantom and uh, <laughs> hit me with that demon. Oh, now, we, well, demons are the whole thing. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I'll give me that spirit. Yeah. Oh, I just want I, it's. That possibility is fucking fun to me. Mm-hmm. I just... I'm trying to think. What do you... Because obviously it is taking your spirit energy out of you. I don't imagine that would feel good at all. I imagine you're just getting tired really fucking quick. Yeah, it's like... Uh, yeah, I can't oh, imagine it draining you forever. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Like, I can't imagine it draining you being like, well, I'm gonna die now because... I got that ghost puss, but it's out of what cost. <laughs> I may have gone it, but I've aged like 50 years. <laughs> <laughs> I've permanently aged to ghost puss. Oh, this goodness. is the worst outcome. So, yeah, I think this would be a very... I would do it for a Halloween party sort of thing. But it was like, speaking of the times, yeah. Like a on- themed, like something themed? Yeah, like a fun... 
celebrational ho- like spooky holiday i would go to a ghost girl brothel house and i'm just like yeah this is what i'm doing tonight <laughs> this is a ghost girl spooky brothel yeah i would too yeah, yeah that sounds like fun mm-hmm. but the, i don't know a lot of the fun things that you want to do or can do aren't really there because like what what okay for you booet booet's your favorite yes you love booet Yes. But in reality, I, what could you do with Buet that you couldn't just do with a normal girl? Float. Okay. <laughs> ectoplasm fun. That's all I fun. got. Ectoplasm fun. That's all I got. <laughs> Listen, you could have the slimy ectoplasm fun. Oh, yeah. True. You could true. totally do that. You could also... Uh... I, think, I think one thing that we didn't think about is how you could just fuck with people with her like straight up be like you could you could fuck her in secret yeah oh that's fun it would you could literally just you could do public like exhibitionism without actually having to show anyone yes (laughs) yes i mean i've i've fucked on a plane before yeah there you go and like that was fun but it was also very Oh, God, if anyone catches us, we are 10 levels of screwed. Mm-hmm. What are you going to prove, huh? Ghost gave me a blowjob? What? <laughs> Wait, what? You going to prove that's, that? That's why you just do it in a park like I did once. <laughs> <laughs> You've never told me that. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, tell us. Tell, tell everyone. Oh, goodness. All right. No so. name dropping, but just basically what's it me and one of my girl one of my girlfriends at the time uh we went out we went to a park just kind of walked around a little bit and we we sat down on the bench just kind of like talking doing lovey-dovey stuff then we both got just really horny and we went out to or we went off the walking path we were on Uh uh-huh went into the little wooded park Part, uh, right next to the fence. Oh for my the god! Baseball people actually field. do that. You actually did that. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen that in hentai, but I've never actually heard or seen anyone do that before. Yeah, we went a little bit off the uh, walking trail. We went into a little bit of a wooded part, uh, right next to the fence of a baseball field, and uh, where all we the did kids it. were playing. Did you do put on a show for the kids? No, there were no kids there. Thank goodness. <laughs> Thank God. We almost it's... got we almost got caught by a dude walking his dog, but it's... listen, he probably want to join. Yeah, we wouldn't let him though. No, <laughs> if he wanted to watch, that'd probably be a different listen, story. The reason but, why she's yeah. your ex is because she was like, "Yeah, come on, cuck him." <laughs> it's his no. favorite. No, no, <laughs> Niet. nine, nine. Um, I think that's all we can say for Ghost Girls. If I if I had to say, I think I'd just stick it with a five. I think the idea uh, of of secret exhibit ex uh, exhibit bleh, I can't say the fucking word exhibitionism exhibitionism. Thank you. Is fun. I think the um, actual like messing with their insides because they can feel it, but it's ghost and you could just literally fuck them anywhere and they'd feel it is fun. Hmm. I think the brain jacking you is actually pretty interesting. <laughs> that that's an interesting dynamic. But would sure. I go for it? Would I be really into it? Would I be like, oh yeah, this is a ten out of ten every single time? I like a five, maybe pushing a six, but a five. Hmm. That's um. That's my end. Uh, I think for me, overall, I'd probably give this a four. You went down significantly. I did. Yes. The main problem is, is that, yes, much like you, as much as I like the exhibitionism, uh, I don't want to age however many years just to bang one and actually feel something. <laughs> yeah, it takes a while. Like, it's that's yeah. like dedication. Mm-hmm. So I'd probably do this like once, like maybe once every couple of years on Halloween, Maybe. Maybe. Even then, like I'd probably go to a different kind of spoopy brothel. Yes, I I would I would agree. Wow, this is a long episode actually. Yeah. All right. On that note, I think we'll call it there. Tell us what you would rate a ghost girl, and what kind of ghost girl would you be into, and how you would fuck them.
Yes, and be sure to check out the lovely artists who drew the thumbnail for yeah. this episode. They will do a magnificent job I already see into the future. <laughs> Make sure to like and subscribe the video, it, or like the video and subscribe to us if you want to see more of us. And if be you sure want. to check out our twit twits. Yeah, if you want. If, but if not, you don't have to. Just, just, just enjoy listening to us and chill. Exactly. Yeah. All right, thanks for listening, everyone. Yes, goodbye. Bye.